He can teach anything he wants to in his church. The problem is that he is sending little groupies into other people's churches. And that is wrong. Uh, I spoke with a Canadian pastor. And a, a young couple came to his church one Sunday morning. They said they liked it. They were very nice people. Then Sunday night, that night, they came in passing out Stephen Anderson DVDs and telling people to watch them. The pastor told him, I don't want that done in my church. And he said, I don't want you coming back. So you know what he did? The guy the next Sunday night sent two other Stephen Anderson clones, and they did it. Just kind of a slap, a pastor in the face gesture. I know of a church in uh, Colorado where uh, a couple joined, and then as soon as they joined, they started proselyting and trying to send people to Phoenix, Arizona. If you listen to the testimonies of the people in Phoenix, his church is not growing because he's knocking on doors in Phoenix. His church is growing because he's sending people into churches and they're stealing other people's members. They're teaching things behind the pastor's back. Uh, I talked to a pastor in Ohio. Uh, he said that on a Sunday morning, some Stephen Anderson followers came in and passed out flyers and in invitations they were to a movie premiere that night at five o'clock, Sunday night. And then, oops, incidentally at six o'clock, they're gonna have an evening church service. 